This is Did You Do It? It's 1.15 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, July 14th, 2018. And we're currently at the gisgeography.com website. Uh, the particular page I'm on is the big satellite list, 50 satellites, 30 words or less. Uh, okay, now I saved the shortcut uh, some time ago because I'm going to be going through all these satellites and see what kind of real-time information or data we can get out of them. But that's not why I'm here. I mean, I, I scanned down there, but this is what I did this morning. Clicked on mapping, okay? And it took me to this page here. And I'm scrolling down, just looking at the dip different types of maps and cartography and active fires and got to the second one. This interested me a little bit. API examples, 15 high-tech web maps and web scenes. So I clicked on that one. And it took me here. All right, that's okay. Well, it took me to this page. I'm gonna show you. I'm not accepting their cookies, by the way. That's probably why they're giving me a delay. Okay, so it took me there, and I'm scrolling down. I'm not interested in the wind fields right now. I don't have time to learn about that. Uh, point cloud layers. I read that one. It's interesting. Got to do a lot of stuff. Don't know how to do. Uh, windmill speeds. There's the wind again. Interesting, but uh, not my forte. I saw someone do something on, on this one before, the 3D layer. But this is when I got here. Animate color variable, New York construction. This animates building construction in New York since New York City since 1934. Well, that's right after the Great Depression. So I clicked on that, and it took me here. And Still not going to accept their cookies just yet. I expanded the view. I did allow this once, like they're asking me. I don't know why. And it kind of gave you it in the middle. But now, what you need to do, what I thought was cool, is go all the way back. Okay, you got to hit the pause button over here. And then now you're in control. Then you can grab the slider bar. Now right, let's hit play. There it is. Now, what I'm about to show you here, it's just pretty cool. Now, the buildings that are popping up in blue are the, if you look over here on the left in the corner, it tells you what year it is. And it goes back to 1880. And up here, a little legend, it shows you the blue buildings, as you see them occur, are the buildings that took place, the building that took place in the year that they're showing. So 1880, there's just a couple buildings. The uh, purple ones and the magenta ones were before 1860 and even before 1830 but there's not much in new york at that time uh on manhattan island but we're going to go forward a little bit okay i'm gonna pause it we're in 1882 now watch not much just watch the blues 1883 okay there's another more 1887 some more building popping up 1889 slowly but it's building 1893, 1895, not much. It's popping up. 18, 1899, whoa. 1880, 1898, 1899. Oh, what a small building boom there. Okay, so from 1889, well, look at that. Holy smokes. A lot of money. Look at all that took place, all that building that took place in 1900. That's cool as shit. <laughs> okay, so let's check out the progress. 1900, 1901, quite a lot of expanding going on there. 1902, 03, 04, 05, it's growing and growing. A lot going on. 1912, look at this. 1960, okay, this is World War I coming in here. Okay, this is, okay, World War I's right in here somewhere. So you'd expect it to slow down a little bit during the war, and it did. Well, there's 1920, a little boom happened there. But then it's kind of slow going. Here's uh, the Great Depression right in here. Not so much happening. Just, it's growing, though. And then uh, somewhere in here, the Empire State Building was built. Cheap labor after the uh, Great Depression. More unemployed people, cheaper you get them. Okay, uh... So 1940, here's World War II going on. It's just kind of slow, slow 
46. Slowly she goes. 51, 52, 56. It's, it's growing, but I mean, it's a lot slower than it was. What was that? That's cool. 1960, 1959, 1960, they did that on the river. Uh, so anyway, I just think this is cool. 1960s. It shows you the footprints of the buildings as they were built. I'm going to give you all the links. 1990. Okay, let's see what happens after 2001. 2000, 2001. Okay, building picks up a little bit after that. Where'd that money come from? An interest in New York all of a sudden. Well, I mean, not like uh, in the early 1900s, of course. 98, 99, 1898, 1899, 19, oh my gosh, look at that. Where did that money come from? It's phenomenal. But then I expected a little building boom after 2001, and it, it happened, but uh, you know, there wasn't much space really in town. It was expensive. Anyway, I'm going to leave you all these links. And uh, thank you for your time. Did you do it?